Now, the reason I'm going to turn it this way this time, because where it's all kind of crumbling on top, the um, these here strings, wires that go through it, is picking up on the crumbly stuff on top, and then it's pulling it through the soap. So what's happening is it's leaving kind of some grain lines because it's pulling that down. Now, even this way, I'm going to get the same thing just because that's on that side, but I won't get it as much. The ideal thing would be for me to turn it the other way, but then how do I line it up properly if I turned it, if I turned it this way, for example? I know I could probably line it up on the edge of that, but is it going to stay in place? And that would be the ideal way to do it. Now, maybe I'll try it that way and see what happens. But uh, I'm just hoping it stays. I'm just hoping it stays in place. I'm just thinking where it's taken so hard to pull on it. See it? Yeah. See what it's doing? It's pushing it, pushing it forward. So I guess I'm just going to ruin this one. See what happens. So yeah, I do maybe get less drag lines going through it, but I don't like the way, I don't like the way it pulled through. I pulled it forward. I don't know. Some of them might have even went crooked. I'll see what happens, but. So, originally. I was going to turn it this way. So let's do it this way this time. And see, since it's up against the back, it's up against the back nice and tight. I have to clean all these off again. Drop my alcohol. Spray a little alcohol on this. And uh, go down and clean them. No sense in me trying to turn it sideways and to save it from getting lines on it if I'm not going to clean these off. So I have to clean these off every time. Now, okay, let's try it this way and see what happens. Well, that went through a lot easier, too. Of course, I'm not trying to drag through as many soap as I was before. There's fewer. Fewer soap on it. Yeah. I love it. I love this machine so much. It's one of the best gifts I've brought myself. Well, besides, I desperately needed a new telephone. My phone and mine, I couldn't do anything on. And I refused to pay $1,200, $2,000, even $600 for a phone. Call me cheap, call me whatever. I like to say I'm frugal. But I found a really good deal. Thank you for watching and have a naturally nice day.